Well, all the cards are scrapped. Uh, okay. You a little upset there, Kenny? Yeah. I can understand that. Why is there a biohazard sticker on the wall there? Like, no one had the time to quarantine the area when everyone's going to shit. You think everyone's safe back at the house? Safe as anyone can be these days, I guess. I just yeah. hate leaving Clementine alone. As if walkers weren't bad enough, now we got this crazy motherfucker on the radio stalking us. Won't be a problem once we get out on the walk. <sighs> River's just a few blocks up ahead. Okay. Oh, God. More Son fucking bells. The bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. And how did we miss what these guys? What the hell is going on? Like we passed right by them. How the hell did we miss these guys? Uh, distraction, so they can kill us. Maybe whoever's ringing that is just trying to distract us, create a diversion. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Yeah. I see what you did there, Kenny. So what, it was all of like three and a half zombies? Let's keep moving. I say a half because the one's crawling on the ground and he can't really do shit. That was all of like... You know, I've Still killed more zombies than that stupid I fucking think game. Oh my god. I mean, yeah. What the fuck else did you expect? There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Uh, it doesn't look like it. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Fine, fuck you too, Kenny. Jump in the water, see if I give a fuck. Yeah, there's no way you're moving that shit. This one might still be salvageable. Uh, fuck. Kenny, get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh, yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Tell you what. If I ever need an expert opinion on American history, I'll be sure to ask. But how about you leave the nautical shit to me? God damn it, Kenny. You're such a fucking asshole now. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I could probably I see it from here. Too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. God damn. All right. Look through telescope. Fine, I'll do it just to satisfy your fucking needs, Kenny. Great. Needs a quarter to work. Can I just bash it? Damn. Built solid. Uh. Don't think I'm gonna see anything until I find a quarter. Can I just. They're still alive on spikes and shit? It looked like what the, uh, the what was that? The it looks like what the Geth were doing to the husks. What is the this Mass Effect. To be some kind of warning? We'll do something like this. Oh uh, yeah, okay. Cause you can totally do anything to me. All right, well, whatever. Now they're walkers. Now they're they were zombies. Now they're walkers. Fucking game. Uh, let's see this way. I can't do anything because invisible walls. 
I need a quarter, god damn it. There has to be something in the dumpster. Because people throw away change all the time. There's that, don't care. Oh. Wait, no, open the cash register. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Yeah, that would have been too easy. Uh huh. All right. I should probably stick close to Kenny. It's too dangerous out here. I can't. There's no. I'm trying to find a quarter, goddammit. That's all I'm trying to look for. Invisible wall. I can't go on the pavement. Okay, sure, whatever. Newspaper machine? Locked. I can bash it. One quarter in that newspaper machine. One goddamn quarter. Fuck! Really? What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the water line, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the fuck is your... Yeah, they're, they're all... What the... What the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Yep. All right, let's see what I can find. Abandoned, like every other place. How can you tell that's abandoned just by looking at the shit? Plenty of docks, no boats. Okay. No way that one's salvageable. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. And then that's the correct one. What the hell? What? Oh. Okay. Get down. Get down. What was that? Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? I mean, we're not really. We didn't come here looking for trouble. Yeah, well, it seems to have a way of finding us anyway. God damn it, Look, Kenny! This could be the guy from the radio, the one who's been messing with us. If he is, we can put an end to it right now. Okay, you head up the middle. Why of the do street. we have to do this I'll shit? Go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. This is stupid. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. And of course, whoever that is didn't see Kenny at the corner of his eye. I thought you were gonna go around. Oh god. You probably know I'm coming. What the? Ah. No. <sighs> Stop it. Yeah, you want to try that again? Lee? What the fuck? Clem? Why is... I, I don't under... Okay, yeah, you're a girl, so I... You're not from Crawford. What? Uh... Have you been following us? Following you? Mind if I get up? Slowly. Why is Clementine here? Why, why does she follow us? Why would you lower your gun down? You don't know if she's fucking gonna kill you or not. God damn it. I almost said don't, but I fucking missed no, the opportunity. He's not. 
Who the hell are you people? We're just people. Uh, I asked you first. I asked you first. The name's Molly. Okay. Molly, I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. <laughs> oh, God. You're not going to say hi back? You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? Uh, I'm from Macon? No, I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. Dude! What's the deal with this Crawford Fucking place? Kenny. You sure you want to know? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero-tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Mainly because we're outside of the barrier? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Whoa. What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survive. Wow. While the rest of the world went to shit around them. Goddamn. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. Yeah. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually... I mean, I mean kids? No. The children, they just forced to leave, along with their parents. Left them to fend for themselves out here in the world. Why? Like I said, zero tolerance. Crawford got rid of anyone that couldn't pitch in, pull their own weight. The way they looked at it, those people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed. Fuck. A drain on their precious resources. Oh, god damn. That's... How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. That's pretty fucked up. I'm not gonna lie about that. That's really fucked up. Yeah, come to what are you doing here? What the hell are you doing here? How'd you get out of the house? Well, Meat started getting really sick. Krista and Ben had to take him upstairs. I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. So you followed us here. Was that you at our house this morning? Watching me through the back fence? Hell no. Believe it or not, I've got better things to do with my time. Believe it or not. I don't believe it because, I mean, you're in an apocalypse. Nothing's going to change. You know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. Okay. I knew it. Okay. Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us. Fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. I agree with Molly. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raised the dead all around us. Oh, no. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That was pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? We're just you? a group of people, goddammit. We're looking... Fuck for trying to survive. We're just trying to survive, same as you. And the only way we're gonna survive is by getting on a boat and getting the hell out of here. No. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. Yeah. There's gotta be something. Nope. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, obviously. Mom, you want to keep your voice down? No. Shit. 
Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Great. Yeah. Just great. All right. Could, kind of figured this would happen. Isn't that the the way we came? Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a? Okay, so. Just gonna let her go? Hey, you can't just leave us that here. Was, I wasn't really? paying attention. Watch. Wow. No, please, please don't leave us. Wow. Okay. So you're just gonna have a change of heart because Clementine? Come on, make it fast. Wow. You. you if it wasn't for Clementine, we'd be fucked. Oh fuck me! Come on, come on, hurry! What the hell? I just threw him up there. Me, come on! Me, come on! Come on One good jump. Come on. Wow. I saw your hand drop me. That's no, fucked up. Me. Why would I push the dumpster? Hurry! Oh, because it's, I can use it as a. Okay. Climb the fucking dumpster, Lee, goddammit. Come on, Lee! Get your ass out of there! Ah, can't get it open! Here, use that to pry it open. So you just throw your climbing pick down at me, Molly? Okay. Lee! Okay, so they're just gonna... I'm, they don't follow me in. They don't fall in or anything. All right, sure. I'll, I'll play you along, I guess. Oh, so okay. Well, you're dead now. I don't think that the Clementine. Can you hear me? No. If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. All right, so whatever. Shit. Uh, anything around here? Nothing. Nothing I need to worry about. Don't care. <laughs>